Right, let's talk about dual flow hydraulics and how to set them up. The two most important things you're gonna to need to know is your pressure and flow rates of both your attachment and also your excavator. Now that you know that your attachment is compatible with your excavator, we can vent both of the auxiliary circuits and then couple up our hoses to the auxiliary outputs that you'll find on the excavator boom. Now with the hoses coupled up, let's jump into the hot seat and I'll show you how to adjust the flow rates. Right, let's start. First, get the engine on. Then ramp up the revs, hit the auxiliary button, and let's see how this attachment is performing. So what have we found from our test? Well, auxiliary two is running absolutely fine, which turns the grab selector, but auxiliary one is running a little bit quick, which is the auxiliary that opens and closes the bucket. So to make those small changes, what we're gonna do is go into our onboard computer, select the attachment that we're using, which is a grab. As we can see, auxiliary two, which is operating the turning of the grab, is operating at full flow, which is absolutely fine. The adjustment that we need to make is on the closing on the bucket, which is on the right-hand pilot control. So we're going to slide on over to the right-hand side and make a small adjustment to the opening and closing of the bucket there. Save those settings, and then we can perform our next test to ensure that the flow rates are working perfectly. Right, that's much better and much more controlled and that's exactly how you change the flow rate of your dual flow attachment on your excavator. Hope this helps.